All right, so today I'm going to be tuning up this Cub Cadet uh, 139cc overhead valve walk behind lawnmower. And um, I'm not going to bore you with the details about oil changes and spark plug and stuff like that. But I went ahead and took the, uh, the blade off and I found a blade adapter needed to be replaced. So uh, let me flip this over and show you what I'm talking about. All right, so the blade normally sits here on this blade adapter and there are two holes in the blade and those two holes usually line up to, with two little nubs that are on the blade adapter well that those nubs are gone in fact this blade was crooked because it wasn't sitting properly in there so that blade adapter adapter is shot this is the uh, the bolt that holds it on so you see there's two little nubs on here and those are intact so that holds it on like so but we need to replace this blade adapter and I cannot get it off. I've been pounding. I should just slide off, right? But this is pretty rusty, and uh, I can't get it off. I applied heat, but I'm gonna go use uh, my uh, my gear puller, and we're gonna pull it off that way. So let me show you how I'm gonna do that. I have here what is a two or a three um, arm gear puller, and I set it up so it's two and uh, what I'm going to do is put it on here but before I do that let's take the original bolt and just turn that in a little ways and then back this off a little bit get those ears or arms whatever on either side of that adapter and start turning it just a little bit here Try to stay in the center of the bolt. And there we go. Now I grab my, my socket of the right size. And I'm going to start to slowly turn. And hopefully this will start pulling out. So let's get a closer view. A different angle and see if you can see that happening all right let's see if this will work i think we got her all right let's back this off bolt out oh look at that we got her look at how rusted that was inside so we're gonna go get a new blade adapter we'll clean this up put a little anti-seize on it and put the blade back on after it's sharp so that was that so if you learned something today I appreciate the uh, subscription and uh, thanks for watching and one more quick thought, if you're interested in a gear puller like this, I picked this up at my local Fleet Farm. That's a store in Green Bay, Wisconsin. Um, there's also in Wisconsin a Blaine's Farm and Fleet. I don't know if they're related, but this particular one, if it makes any sense, says Pro Grade 18218. There you go. And uh, I don't remember what I paid for it, but it wasn't a whole lot. And this thing is coming in handy quite a bit, so go get yourself a, a three-gear puller.